Do not attempt to adjust your screen. Forbes DVD Live is taking over. I want to um, touch on it because it's fresh and it's new, and um, I think we can go out with this footage first. What do you think about the Eric Garner situation? I think the Eric Garner situation is just a reflection of the hostility towards black people by the police. And I think that one of the things that uh, we have to address and that we have to understand is the badge says serve and protect. Police, when they come through the hoods, they remind me of pre-football. You know how the niggas be yeah, getting yeah, amped yeah, up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like they amp themselves up. Like they drive through the hood and the look that they give you is like hunters. Yeah. And it's like that there has to be a restructuring of how they ought, of how police are hired. Because you can't take a white boy and put him amongst us because he doesn't understand us. It could be something simple. That shit was some simple shit that should have never happened. Yeah. Every garden situation. Might be if it's a, sometimes when there's cops that understand it. Like Atlanta, they have a lot of black officers. And I've noticed situations where they rectify the situation. They actually know the people in the Exactly. Community. Whereas a white cop, it could be something simple. It could be little kids slap box and laughing. Cop, hey, 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 what's going on over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the fuck you got your gun out for is little kids. Or yeah. so the hostility, the Eric Garner situation is just a reflection of the hostility. But I find it incredibly ironic that it happened during the 25th anniversary of uh Fight the power, yeah. the public enemy shit. Yeah. Because that shit reminds me of Radio Rock. The right thing, yeah. yeah. Craziness. Um, the hip hop police is it real? Hip hop police is real and a real deal. <laughs> Holy Phil. and um, that's why a lot of times um, I move different. You know, um, I definitely don't walk around no gun on me like that no more. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. rappers already showed you, like you go into jail, you carry a gun. They follow us. It's basically like uh, the new what's that? Coin Telepro. Mm -hmm. That's basically that. Because um, they don't follow around the rockers. And there's some rockers that got some motherfucking mean guns. And they got dope on them. And they you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the whole so of shit. It's definitely a, there's, it's definitely a hip hop league. I actually know one of the guys that used to be down, Derek used to be down to hip hop league. He made a book about it. So it's real. And they got files on niggas and everything. You know what I'm saying? So they, it, it's incredible. They have files on you and they read your shit. I've seen. I've seen fouls, and I was like, wow. Why, why aren't the rappers fighting for Eric Garner? I mean, I just, this generation is soft. Like, these niggas, they just, they don't... When do niggas get pussy? Niggas fight over new Jordans. Yeah. They don't fight over new laws. Um, it's not too many stand-up dudes. But when did niggas get so pussy? I don't know. <laughs> I think when that, I think when that when that money I think money made people soft, and I think uh, I think the removal of our conscious voices and our warriors. The warrior class was was erased from rap. Our warrior class was erased or silenced, and and the people that that that's that's for the for the for us to look up to are soft. Yeah. No disrespect. I mean, fuck if they take it like that, whatever. Yeah. But I'm not trying to disrespect. Yeah. But <laughs> it is what it is. We don't have that warrior class. We should have stood up for Eric. Every garden. We should have stood up for uh, Trayvon more, but people put their hoodies on and do bullshit protests. The hashtag is not yeah, protest. Yeah, that's 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 that's. You can't you can't be a shiny shoe revolutionary. Your shoes have to get dirty. You have to walk wow. to people. Wow. So. Um, we got one more Twitter question before we get out of here. Somebody wanted to know what do you think about um, the Illuminati fear mongering on the internet? I don't care about that shit. I don't care about Illuminati. I'm too. I'm too. I'm me. I'm not even eligible to be a member of that shit. <laughs> so I don't. I don't care about that shit. Let them do. Keep doing what they're doing, man. All right. So yo, um, I just need you to look in this camera and just let them know we on ForbesDVD.com. Yo, what up? We on ForbesDVD.com. This is Mega. It's been a pleasure. Keep doing what y'all do, brother. I got your back, 100%. Mm -hmm. Forbes DVD.com